Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm Tiana and in today's video I have a huge Sephora sale haul. Um, I'm VIB Rouge so I got everything for 20% off and I'm like super excited to show you all what I picked out but um, I know I've been gone for a while. I have been having like some health problems and stuff as you guys know like with my brain and that kind of thing. It's like been really hard and like mentally like draining so you know with everything going on like work and just everything i just haven't really been in a place where i wanted to like sit down and film a video but i'm finally starting to like feel like myself again and i'm happy to be back i hope that i can like keep up posting but you know having a full-time job makes it a little bit harder so anyway without any further ado um i'm gonna get into this haul but first don't forget to subscribe down below and then follow me on Instagram and TikTok. I am way more active on TikTok just because, you know, I do everything from my phone and there's no editing. Like, that's where I mainly post content now. So let's go ahead and dig into this. I got some really good stuff. Um, let's go in order of like most expensive to least expensive. So I spent in total probably around five or six hundred dollars. Like I don't exactly know, but I spent a lot of money. And these two fragrances from Kaoli were mainly like what broke the bank, I would say. So we have Vanilla 28 and then Eden Juicy Apple 01. But yeah, these are both Eau de Parf perfume or however you pronounce that it's like french but um first i'll show you guys vanilla 28 this one has been like so popular on tiktok but the notes are vanilla orchid tonka absolute brown sugar amber woods and musk and i will say this is like a perfect kind of like winter vanilla scent winter and fall but like you can wear it in the summer i just personally get more like like cozy vibes from it but i wanted to buy it while it was on sale because it's originally 125 and i got it for like whatever 20 percent off of that is but it's beautiful smells really good this one like lasts pretty long on the skin and on clothing and i have kind of like a juvenile scent preference so i love you know vanilla and like sweet stuff bath and body works vibes but this is this is like warm vanilla sugar, but elevated for an adult. So perfect for me. And then the Eden Juicy Apple 01. This is gonna be like my summer, spring, summer scent. I'm wearing it right now. And let me get it out of the packaging. It's like kind of getting stuck in there. The notes of this are Juicy Red Apple, Wild Berries, Jasmine, Lychee, Vanilla Flower, and Sensual Musk. And to me, it reminds me of like winter candy apple but you know for an adult and yeah like it just smells like so delicious i love it and it's sweet fruity like perfect for the summer the scents that i wear like i definitely could see like a high schooler or like a middle schooler wearing them like i'm not into like mature scents by any means so those were like the two most expensive things and then next um, I got the Giorgio, Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk in the shade 8. This is like my favorite high-end foundation and I would highly recommend buying this on sale. Like I already have it but mine is running out so I wanted to get a restock for 20% off obviously but it's just perfect for like any skin type. I like how it's kind of natural and like medium coverage because I don't like full coverage foundations it's glowy but like you know you can make it more or less glowy depending on like your skin prep and like how you set your foundation this is just the best thing that i've ever put on my face like i love it so much and then another expensive item i would recommend is the five stars retinoid and niacinamide eye serum by sunday riley this is like my holy grail eye serum i think i've gone through three of them i started using this i think in 2021 or 2022 and like the bottles last a long time so it's 65 dollars but like it'll last you a good maybe like five six months so yeah i use this every night and makes my eyes look pretty good sorry if you can hear vacuuming in the background my dad is like vacuuming so i'm just gonna keep going but hopefully it's not too like distracting okay so next i got this sephora favorites vacay all day and i bought this because it has the tower 28 spray 
this is like not wanting to oh okay you have to like rip it open but the tower 28 spray cleared up my like i don't want to say acne but like i got tiny bumps on my face like tiny clogged pores the tower 28 spray kind of cleared them up in my opinion i think that's what it was but um in this little kit you get this obviously that i love you get a mini debronzy i love debronzy it's like my favorite skincare product and then the other two things i was excited for are this too faced better than sex mascara this is what i use it's waterproof and it holds the curl and then a mini anastasia clear brow gel i use that you also get a mini glow screen um this low-key burns my eyes but sometimes i'm just like i'm gonna use it anyway like i don't care this mario this is full size i've never tried anything by makeup by mario before um but yeah i know people are obsessed with some of his like skin products but i kind of like to stick to classic stuff like dior and giorgio armani like i don't really branch out into like new brands as much so let me know if i should try it way scalp and body scrub whoops this slather topicals exfoliating body serum i could put this on my back i guess like to clear up any like clogged pores and stuff and then you get this tiny freck pen and this laura mercier tinted moisturizer blush so that's what you get in this kit honestly a lot of the stuff like the mini stuff i'm probably going to give away to friends but what made it worth it to me were like these products these four products right here so i would recommend like checking out their little kits because they're usually a pretty good deal and then i'll definitely have to try out this like mario thingy anyway um moving on i got this say glowy super gel in the shade sun glow and i'm wearing it right now like i put this kind of stuff under my foundation or like mixed into my foundation just to give me more of a glow and this is like such a beautiful shade i influenced my coworker to buy it in the lighter color because she has fair skin but i just love this it's a deep bronzy dupe for sure but this one has like really good ingredients that are good for your skin so honestly for me like if i wasn't wearing makeup i would just do like my skincare routine and then put this on like all over my face okay then moving on my two favorite new beauty finds i guess would be these two products right here so we have the patrick ta brow lamination thing i got this because alex earl on tiktok always uses it and it looks super fast and easy so i've been using it and it just basically like sticks your brows into place and it still looks like really natural i used to use the refi one but it would like leave white flecks and it was just like not it wasn't user friendly but this is definitely like super easy um for on the go and it just like looks really good then we also have the hourglass vanish concealer in the shade beach and i put it on like this is my new favorite concealer like i just love this it looks so good and it's the perfect like i picked a really good color for my skin so this is definitely a new favorite the last two things that were in here are the say slip tint in the shade five so i am restocking this because mine is about halfway empty but this is what it looks like i wear this every day to work and it's just like a good product and i could see myself definitely like mixing these together and just like rubbing it on my face i just love say products because i work a corporate i work 7 30 to 4 so most of the time if i'm putting on makeup i'm putting it on at 6 in the morning and i'm taking it off at like 5 or 6 p.m so that's 12 hours and i'm starting to become more conscious of the ingredients that i'm putting on my face and like what i'm allowing my skin to absorb i don't want to like create acne or like other problems so i'm pretty conscious about that stuff now and i just like clean beauty brands i feel like more comfortable with that now so yeah that's why i got that and i would highly recommend it it looks really nice and 
it's light coverage but it evens out your skin tone it like will cover up like if you have like a breakout you know it's not full coverage but it definitely like kind of makes everything look nice and cohesive and the very last thing that i have is the day prickly pear hair oil and i wanted to originally get this plus like they had a kit with um the monsoon moisture stuff and then that pink tube of like whatever i think it's like a styling cream but that sold out i put it in my cart it sold out so i only got my hands on this but so far like i really like it i would put it in my hair but i already have like hair oil in and i don't want to weigh it down but i love this i used it yesterday it just kind of like adds a nice sheen it helps with frizz and flyaways and then i would definitely say it works universally for all hair types because i have like kind of curly coarse hair but then i see people like whitney simmons using it and she has very fine like you know delicate hair and it still looks good but i love a good hair oil so anyway in conclusion that is everything that i got from the sephora sale i did order more stuff so it would have been a bigger haul but unfortunately like three or four of my items were canceled due to like stock issues but pretty good haul so anyway let me know your thoughts in the comments if there's anything else that i should get before the sale goes away and you know that's it so don't forget to like comment and subscribe down below and i will see you all next time